Deep3 here with another Wish product review. And for this episode, we're going to do a, another shoe review for a product I received about two months ago, or I've worn for two months. And I just completely did not have time to do a review on them. And it's these running shoes right here. Uh, got these in black. They look like uh, you're any typical, uh, I guess, knockoff Yeezys or Boosts. They got the ribbed grip on the bottom. Uh, specifically with this shoe compared to the other one if you've watched my previous episode. Uh, this has a much better grip. Had, act, there's actual ta uh, traction. It's not slippery. Uh, the material itself is soft. Uh, perhaps a little bit too soft, so I wouldn't recommend running in them, like aggressive sprinting. Or maybe sprinting in... You could sprint in the grass a little bit. But if you were to sprint on something like blacktop or play sports in these, I would not recommend it. You would, these will burn out the grip really quick. This is after two months. Um, it still has a lot of grip relatively for two months. And the quality of itself, like the structure of it, it's definitely like a sock knit. So don't expect any, um, any foot support. Other than this little cloth holding the shoe's uh, structure in place, it's just going to be material. Even the sh sh laces don't really do anything. It's much more for a design purpose. Now, if I look at the Wish app uh, website here, well, I, I looked at the order history, and when I searched it up, uh, the original product ID was not there, or the store ID was not there. So in order to find a pair like these, you'd have to type in running shoes or running shoes casual, and you have to scroll down here and look for the image. Now the good thing is that they use the same images, or these factories use the same images, stores, whatever. And what you're going to look for is the ones with the ribbed bottom that I just showed you earlier. So it would be this one, or this one. Uh, this is 90% off, 96% off. In order to find the greatest value, I mean, I'd, I'd look at the cheapest base price first, so this one would be $11. And then you also want to tick on the shipping. And this is $4, so for roughly 15 bucks, if you buy it with the other shopper here, you can get it for like $13.90, something like that. Of course, this one would take you what, a month, month for shipping. But uh, there's like a variety of colors. This is the one I got. Uh, there's, a, what, there's a gold, which it does not look like gold. It looks like a mm, khaki. There's a gray and there's a quote green. But uh, I'd highly recommend these shoes if you're just looking for a value purchase. Compared to the other ones I've gotten before, uh, these are very comparable to uh, the Roshis, Nike Roshis that I have in my garage, the second edition. And that's saying a lot for a shoe that only costs $15 versus $60, $200 for a running shoe. Um, that would be it, pretty much. <laughs> Leave a like, subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. If you'd like to see more Wish app reviews for other products, uh, you go ahead and leave a description out there for me to, like, check it out. Maybe I'll buy it. And, you know, till the next episode, we can find out which is in this bad boy. Ooh. I already know what it is. Thanks for watching.